Hi friends, today we are going to talk about how we can create a maintenance view variant for a particular table okay, or a view. So what happens is lots of time there might be a requirement that I will give you a maintenance view for a particular entry so that they can maintain it for something. Okay, so just to give an example, what can be the case is suppose there is a requirement uh, I go to ME23N and here you have this purchasing group, right? And now this purchasing group would be maintained by by a certain uh, um, certain group of people for certain entries only, this purchasing group, okay, 001 or whatever it is. Okay, so in order to do that, and you can find other process areas, like lots of times based on the country, like if the purchasing group is based on a particular country or uh, the company code is based on some particular company code then you will maintain it okay so let's find let's do something different here mm -hmm. so here we will be doing is we go to this transaction sc54 okay. uh, here if you see this is the table that has the purchasing group what i'm going to do is i will just click create okay and um, so here i will just click create uh, the the purchasing the 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 thing the maintenance view okay so what i'm going to do is uh, edit view variant so uh, this is the one and i click on edit view variant and i'll click here and here I will just put CSD11 and that's a test. Okay? And here I'll just click uh, create. He is already defined as a class of cluster. Okay, it's already been defined. That's good. So we will see um, PR. Okay, probably it will not be there. Yeah, there it is. So we'll say uh, variant, variant for. E group, sorry. So we are talking about B group purchasing group, and now we are going to put the table name. Okay, so this is the table name, and it will show this one. Okay, now what we are going to do is the view fields will be by default, it's always the key fields. Okay, now in order to get the other fields, you can just select everything and you click on copy, select everything click copy and now you can see this is the thing that has already been done now here you can say the maintenance status would be display maintenance with restriction you can make it this is customizing table okay uh, because it will store in a you know, transport okay and here we can put the table the select conditions okay now here we can put any select conditions okay but here I will just select one, okay, click this, and we will say click, and we will say anything which is uh, suppose I don't know, greater than or so. If I go to the purchase organization here, what are the numbers? I just want to make sure I'll, I'll do something. So I'll say anything which is less than suppose five five five. Let's see whether it works or not. Okay, so we'll say less than less than or equal to five five five. So less than or equal to five five five. Okay, and I'll save it <coughs> and click local object. Okay, and if you need a transport, you can always put a package and that's and now it's done okay i think did i activate it probably i needed to activate it click to activate okay and now you see warning in sap we just ignore only if it's red error we take into account and now it's local object we got it now we'll just click test variant and here you can see the magic is done so this is very useful especially when you are restricting the the roles the entries for the users you know and uh, it really 
it really helps so let me check whether they can enter anything uh, probably they will be let's create the key within the work area because there is nothing to be created so but um, but they cannot enter this so this is very useful so in this way you maintain it so it's the transaction code is as if 54 and you give the table name and you just go to edit view so it's very easy you give the table name the view name and you just go edit view cluster okay and uh, edit view variant and then do it okay so this is the way it's done okay thank you so um for listening and stay tuned to my sp channel and happy sp learning